Triple-A distinguished 48-year Indiana and national career in secondary education and athletics is about to come to a close. Bill Benner has more in this week's Inside Indiana Sports. Bill. Thanks, Gary. Bob Gardner started out as a teacher, coach, athletic director, principal, and superintendent at Indiana storied Milan High School. Eventually became the commissioner of the Indiana High School Athletic Association, and for the last 10 years has served as the executive director of the Indianapolis-based National Federation of State High School Associations. And early this year, he announced his retirement effective August 1. But before he rides off into that figurative sunset, we thought it would be only appropriate to have Bob as our guest and welcome you to the show. And Bob, again, a great career, 48 years. And, and I, I guess that says why, because that's a long time and it's probably time. Well, that's exactly right, Bill. I've enjoyed every facet of my uh, career, but it's time to pass it off to younger leadership now, and I look forward to the next chapter. A lot of changes uh, over those 48 years, and again, you started out at the, the storied Milan High School, but uh, and then commissioner of the IHSAA, and now with the the uh, state feder the federation, but. Uh, you, you have to witness sea changes, I would guess. Well, there really has been. But, you know, Bill, the one thing that's been constant has been the young people who participate in our programs. And one of the things I'm most proud of is that number of participants grows every year. And, and I, you just came off your convention, your national convention in Chicago. I know you discuss uh, successes, challenges. What, what, as you look back with the Federation, what do you see as some of your highlights? Well, I think one of the things that, that's really been a real highlight has been our education program. And we focus uh, heavily on risk minimization for the student athletes who play our contests, and then also trying to develop good citizens. Uh, our education program uh, is online, and uh, sometime uh, later this month, we'll have the seven millionth course delivered. And uh, our, our focus on concussions uh, was a topic of conversation as well it should be uh, in Chicago among our, uh, our folks and we're really proud of that course. Uh, it's designed, there's a course designed for parents, one for students and one for uh, coaches and administrators and we're about to hit 3.7 million who've seen that course. So that, that's really one of the highlights for me uh, and uh, I, I think that that is paying dividends uh, again for all the young people across America. You also web stream a, a, lot, of, uh, a lot of content. We do, we've, we've built our own web streaming network. Uh, it's called the NFHS network. Uh, almost all of our state associations are participating in that. And this school year we delivered over 48,000 uh, sporting events and we're not limiting the sports because as you know we also have the performing arts speech theater debate and music and those are an important part of our organization and those events are also web stream live on the NFHS. One network. of the things I've, I find really uh, fulfilling and inspiring is the message based uh, by the Federation and, and, and the IHSAA do wonderful message based uh, uh, themes on based on high school athletics. Well, I think that's very important, Bill. Sometimes in the, in this world we live in today, uh, the focus gets out of uh, out of focus, if you will, blurred. Uh, when people think it's all about winning, and it's about so much more than that, uh, young people's opportunities to participate, to grow and learn, uh, are so uh, important to their development. And I think the IHSA has done a terrific job, and of course we've assisted at the national level uh, with all state associations carrying that important message. Your successor will be Carissa Niehoff. We look forward to having her on this program and introducing her to the Indianapolis audience, uh, the, the Indiana audience, Connecticut, from Connecticut. Uh, what kind of, uh, as we wrap up, what kind of advice have you shared with Carissa? Well, I think to uh, Carissa, she'll, she'll bring a new energy, a new focus. She's a terrific person. Uh, the challenges will remain uh, as they always uh, will uh, for anybody that sits in that seat, but to uh, be Carissa. She can't be me. She's got to be herself, and she'll be extremely effective if she does that. Well, Bob, we certainly, again, thank you for an outstanding 48-year career in all uh, facets of, of high school uh, uh, sports and, and participation, and uh, you just had a great career. And grandkids and travel. That's, that's the target. There you go. <laughs> Gary, back to you.